Morning. What are you doing here? I thought you were at work today. Stay off, remember? Time to fist last week. I thought we could spend the day together. Do you know, I've got a brain like I said, I completely forgot. Oh, I better clean this mess up. No, just leave it. No, but I've got two because... I said, just leave it. Precise. I've already made your breakfast. You have? Don't sound too surprised. I do like to spoil you time to time. Sit at the dining table waiting for you. What's this? Breakfast. I can't see that, but what is it? It's tofu. Tofu? Yeah, tofu. Come on, tuck in. Why would I want tofu for breakfast? And come to think of it, why would I want tofu at any time of the day? I just want to see how you like it. Sorry, I don't follow. I just want to see how you like a meat substitution. But why? Because that's what you've been feeding me, haven't you? Didn't think I'd find out, did you? <sighs> Look, Doug, I can explain. Explain what? Why have you been using long dong silver instead of the real thing? It's not what you think. Oh, you have no idea what I'm thinking. I just wanted to make sure that you were satisfied. It's all it takes three inches to satisfy a woman, Carl. And that's called a credit card. Yeah, and the G-spots are out at the end of the word shopping, isn't it? Yeah, I know. You think this is funny? No, not at all. This explains a lot of things this does. What do you mean? Well, it's obviously me, isn't it? You don't find me attractive in that way anymore. Or I don't turn you on. You've had to resort to Mr Plastic Fantastic here. No, it, it's nothing like that at all. That will explain why in our seven years together we've never seen each other naked. Always has to be with the lights out when it comes to putting the banana in the fruit salad. It's not you, it's me. Oh, that old chestnut. I suppose next you're going to tell me that you love me but you're not in love with me. It's me that feels inadequate. It's me that's ashamed of my body. It's got nothing to do with you or yours. Why haven't you talked about it then? I could listen. What was that? Nothing. No, you muttered something then. What was it? I said nothing. Wow, not only can you not use your own dick, but you haven't got a set of balls to go with it. You really are a pathetic excuse for a man, you know that. Look at you. What? You're going to cry now? You might as well carry on using that thing. It's more of a man than you'll ever be. Come to think about it, I don't even know why I'm complaining. It's doing a better job than you ever did. If I think long and hard, I could possibly pinpoint the actual times you didn't use it. Well, that would be quite difficult. Oh yeah, why is that? Because I have never used anything other than our little friend there. So, you want to bang on about how pathetic I am as a man? Why don't we look at the fact that you're nothing but a lying, two-faced, dishrag cunt? You sit there with that self-righteous, smug expression all over your face, barking at me all the time. Explain this. Explain that. Well, you explain something to me, bitch. If the only thing you've had inside you from me is that thing, how do you explain our two children? Yeah, that's what I thought. You know what? You're right. I'm not much of a man, but that's nothing to do with my appearance or the size of my dick. It's the fact that I've had to put up with your bullshit all these years. Yeah, didn't think I knew, did you? You see this? I never lost the wedding ring. It just disappeared when I realised that somebody else had opened the gates of Mordor. What, so, you got nothing to say? Is your mouth open like that through shock? Or are you just warming up for your next dongathon? I'd best get that. Leave it. But it's the postman. How do you know it's the postman? That's his knock. <laughs> right, okay, so the postman has a knock, does he? Well, I suppose the milkman has a knock as well, does he? And the bin man. But, nah, actually, wouldn't be the big man, would it? No, 
because he has to take the rubbish with him, doesn't he? Not bad, actually.